A Dandelion's Life, written and illustrated by John Himmelman. In late summer, a dandelion seed floats through the air. It hitches a ride in a chipmunk's fur. The seed drops into the soil. A few weeks later, a dandelion plant begins to sprout. Its leaves grow and spread during the fall. In winter, snow covers the dandelion and other plants. It is hard for birds to find food. A red pole eats grass seeds. Below the snow, the dandelion's leaves stay green all winter. Spring rain waters thirsty roots. In early summer, a stem grows up and a dandelion bud forms. Soon, the bud opens and a bright yellow flower head appears. The head contains dozens of little flowers. A skipper visits the dandelion flowers for nectar. The skipper will not fight with a wasp. It flies away. In late afternoon, the flower head closes. At night, a cricket comes out from under the dandelion's leaves. It fills the warm summer evening with music. As the sun rises, the dandelion flower head opens again. A lawnmower roars across the yard. Luckily, it just misses the dandelion. The dandelion has many visitors. They all like its nectar. Sometimes many visitors come at once. A few days later, the flower head closes for the last time. The dead flowers are slowly pushed out of the head. They are replaced by a fuzzy ball of seeds. The summer breeze lifts the dry, light seeds into the air. Now the dandelion head is bare. The stem withers, but the leaves keep growing. The plant will bud again next spring. There will be many more seasons of dandelion flowers. And many more seasons of seeds in the air. Words you know. Bud the part of a plant that turns into leaves, flowers, or roots. Nectar, a sweet liquid made by flowers that certain insects like to drink. Red pole, a finch that likes snow-covered fields of weeds. Skipper, a small butterfly. Soil, the layers of dead plant matter and dirt that cover the ground. Sprout, to begin to grow.